The three best ways to earn money online in 2018. So more and more of you guys are asking like, what is it that you do? Like, how do you earn money? Like, what, what, what is all this content creation stuff about? And um, basically, I've got my own social media marketing agency called Brandpreneur, where I help businesses grow their business by leveraging social media, uh, marketing and social media advertising. So uh, that is like one of the ways that I earn money online. So basically, I work from my laptop. I don't have any uh, like office or I haven't got like a certain space where to do it. I can just do it from my laptop. And like I'm on the road sometimes when I need to go and meet clients. But most of the time, I'm just in the house on my laptop, like helping these businesses grow through social media. That is also like one of the ways that you can earn money online as well, is by doing social media marketing. And that may sound like a bit intimate, intimidating for people, cause like you don't really know how to do social media marketing or do like Facebook ads or Facebook ad campaigns. And you don't necessarily have to start by doing that. You can also do content creation first. So content creation is basically where yeah, you're still doing social media for a company, but you, all you're doing is like creating photos and making videos for them that they can put on like their Instagram or their Facebook. The next step, like after you've you've sort of like mastered that, uh, where I think the real money is for companies because this is uh, like the, what I'm just going to explain in a minute is the way that they can see how many sales they're getting in because if you put uh, if you do content creation, so if you put like, photos or videos on their Instagram and Facebook and YouTube and stuff like that, they can't really see how many sales they're getting from it. So a great way to sort of work around this and a better way to do social media marketing for them is by paid Facebook and Instagram ad campaigns. This way they can see the return on investment, they can see how much money they're putting in because obviously they are paid campaigns and they're seeing how much money they're getting out. And then obviously the goal is to earn them more money than they're giving you and that they're putting into their social media marketing campaigns. So let's say they give you a thousand euros a month, so on a retainer, so every month you get a thousand euros, the goal is obviously to earn them 2,000 or 3,000 euros back so that they, like, they get a return in money on their investment that they invested in you. So to get started, the best way to do it is to do content creation first. So uh, the videos, like create little videos for them, do uh, like post their photos on Instagram and stuff like that. And what I recommend doing is either invest in a course or seeking coaching from someone else that knows how to do Facebook advertisement and Facebook marketing and just learn from them. The best way to do it is to learn from others. That is also how I did it. Like I bought the Tyler Oprah Social Media Marketing Agency course and I just, that just basically just gave me like a really broad overview of all like the, the possibilities with social media and that sort of like gave me ideas okay like i can do this i'm not really good at that so i'll seek more coaching in this you know i can do this i can master that and you know and so on and so forth basically another tool that you can use to earn money online is affiliate marketing and i don't mean like the the sponsors and stuff like that most people that start youtube or start instagram or anything like that they're always wanting like the sponsors you want like, a sponsorship from this like clothing line or whatever and basically with affiliate marketing, I do not mean that. With affiliate marketing, I mean uh, products or services that you already use that you can recommend to your following or your community. And then in return, you get a percentage of the, of the sales, basically that is your commission by referring those people to that service or product. And you're not scamming your community or you're not gonna lose credibility with your community or with your following because you're not just selling them random stuff or you're not trying to get money off the one, anything like that. You're just referring your community to stuff that you already use, whether that is a service or a product. And like, obviously if they're following you and they wanna say, like they wanna see how you like live your life or how you build your own business or anything like that, and you refer them to stuff that has helped you along the way, then, you know, that's just fine. That's, that's, there's no problem in doing that. And it's definitely nothing to be ashamed of if you do that. So this doesn't mean that you just start promoting like random stuff. What I recommend you do is look at services that you already use now. So like Spotify, Audible, uh, what have you got? TubeBuddy, you've got Active Campaign, ClickFunnels, you know, all stuff like that. Like stuff that you use on a regular basis. Find an affiliate link for them or an affiliate program and refer it to your like, following. Like make a little YouTube video out there. Like for example, the other day, I use Audible for audiobooks. You know, I listen to a lot of books because, well, 
uh, especially when I just started reading. I hated reading and I just wanted to like listen to them so I can get like a book read or listen to quicker. So I started listening to audiobooks and I used Audible for this. And then like the other day, I recommended uh, my like uh, YouTube watchers to use Audible as well. And then I refer them to like the link in the description box. They didn't have to use it. I didn't like try and sell them it or anything like that. I just said, if you want to use it as well, you can use the link in the description box. And like a few people clicked on it and then I got commission off that as well. And lastly, another way to earn money online in 2018 is by either doing coaching or bringing out your own course. So like I said in the first tip, if you're unsure about a certain subject or you want to know more about a certain topic, then seek coaching from others but it also works the other way around. If you're very knowledgeable on a certain topic or subject, then coach other people how to do it as well. That way, you know, you're teaching them something and you're earning money in return. Like say, for example, uh, I'm quite good at social media marketing nowadays. I'm really good at Facebook advertising and I can teach that to others to show like people how, how they do it, like an Instagram ad campaign or anything like that. And if I, let's say, for example, I charge them 100 euros for an hour, of like me teaching them one-on-one -on -one how to set up a Instagram ad or Instagram marketing or anything like that and they earn a thousand euros off it that's a 10x return for that student so obviously they're happy because they got a return on investment I'm happy because I got a hundred euro for teaching something, something that I already know for an hour and that way you know it's a win-win situation so you both benefit from it also what you can do as well if you've got a lot of people that are asking about a certain topic or subject you can bring out your own course through Teachable. Teachable is like this online platform where you can put or you create your own courses and like you need to go through certain modules like you can't just skip to the bottom one or anything like that. You need to watch every single module. So it's a really easy way to like put all your information in order and then bring out a course, set your price and then people can buy it and they can learn from you. And that is probably the best way to learn in 2018 as well is by buying courses or getting coaching from someone else. Cause like obviously you can buy an official course or you can like do like a course in uni or buy a book, but nine times out of 10, the information that you get from an official course in uni is 10 years old. Whereas courses online created by others is it's really like cutting edge stuff you know it's stuff that is new it's it's relevant and something that you can apply straight away so anyway guys those are my three tips and tools to earn money online in 2018 obviously the first tip is something i'm already doing which is the social media marketing i've got my own agency called brand Panier. and affiliate marketing tip number two is something i'm really looking into as well not really like haven't really started just yet i'm not earning a lot of money off it because I think we're, uh, like with social media marketing, you only need a few clients to earn a really big sum of money because you are pri providing a lot of value, whereas you do need a bigger following to get like a return on investment to affiliate marketing. And coaching is something I'm looking into as well. Like I've already got like a few little coaching calls, which I'm doing for free at the moment, just to see like how good I am with uh, like teaching someone else my knowledge, you know, like uh, passing my skills over onto the next person, just to see what their like what their results are, and then if I'm happy with what they've what they've been taught or the way I've been the way I've been able to teach it then I might go on to do coaching more often or at a bigger scale. Also, I'm giving like free coaching calls, like free con consultation calls on my Instagram now. Again, just to, to see if I've got, I can build up the social proof for coaching. And the way you can win that is by commenting under like one of my Instagram posts. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll get more of an idea of what I mean. So what you're best doing is just follow me on Instagram, uh, clicking on like the notification button so you get a notification every single time I upload or post. And uh, then like in one of my captions, I'll probably explain a bit more in depth how you can win a free 30 minute, 30 minute or 50 minute consultation call. Depends on what kind of mood I'm in. Maybe do 50 minutes. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap up this video here. Thank you so much for watching. If you've got some out there, let me know in the comments down below. Like the video if you enjoyed watching it. Subscribe to the channel, click on the little bell so you get a notification every single time I upload. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys in the next one. I can't believe I just said that all at one go. <laughs>